Lavender Castle, a place of legend fabled right across the universe. This is our quest to find it. Don't believe it. There's no life anywhere. I'm telling you, the message was as clear as a bell. There's been a massacre. Look! Bodies. There has been a massacre. Oh, poor souls. Whatever could have happened. All right, Roger, let's go down. There's something evil down there, Captain. Let's be cautious. No, let's go down there first, and then we'll be cautious. All right, now fan out. Call me if you find anyone alive. <laughs> uh, oh. They will sleep for hours. And when they wake, they won't remember a thing. <laughs> they will spend the rest of their lives trying to work out how they became my slaves. Hey. Oh. oh, my word. Are you all right, Captain? Miss Liker? Uh, Mr. Isambard, sir? I must get them inside. There you are, Mr. Sproggle. They all seem to be in a deep sleep. I'd better have a look around and see what's going on. You what? Painted cutouts. This whole thing is becoming curiouser and curiouser. Fan incredibly tastic. <laughs> My plan has worked brilliantly. No, it hasn't. You didn't get the robot. There's an old saying, Trump. It takes a robot to catch a robot. Not a cutout. Destroy the robot. Uh, now, was it Captain Thrice once said to me? Uh, oh, yes, discretion is the better part of valor. <laughs> Which roughly translated means run like heck. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> away from here. Ah, the very thing. Mr. Isambard's jetpack. Here, boy. Here, boy. So, you want to play games, do you? Fine. Good boy. Come on. <laughs> Good boy, come on. Good boy. 
Right, my pet, that was fun. Now, take him out. <laughs> At last, I have got my weekend cottage. And I can nest in the such roof. Yes, and with your filthy habits, that'll be the best place for you. <laughs> What a wonderful day, Trump. I've got the Paradox and its entire crew. And I've got my home in a thatched... Look! <gasps> Shut! Why don't you stop him? I can't! He no longer obeys me! But let's get out of here! To take off? You try taking off with a chunk out of your backside. Whoa, whoa there. Well done, my gallant steed. Now back to the paradox. I know you have voice recognition, so here's what I want you to do. What on earth are you doing, Sir Squeakalot? I've chased Dr. Egg on away, Captain Sir. You see, I rode on the spider's back. Rode on the spider's back? What are you talking about? Well, sir, you see, the bodies were only painted pictures that had been laid on the sand. What painted pictures? Ah, well, they're not there anymore, Mr. Roger. Oh, they're not, are they? No, you see, sir, I told the spider to bury them. There's no spider either, Squeaky. Sir Squeakalot, this desert air made us all very sleepy and perhaps it affected you in some way. Oh, you mean he imagined it? Possibly. <laughs> Well, what do you see, Sprobble? Up! Uh, nothing, Captain. Nothing at all. Ah, 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 hey, why don't you stop him? Don't you understand? He's been got at! 